25 years ago, these tenants were poor nomads. They have now become members of a sound agricultural community who have an ever-growing realization of the important part played by the farmer in the progress of his country. Each village council is freely elected by the Sudanese people themselves, and all are encouraged by the government and the cotton companies to manage their own affairs. Throughout the Gazira area, the Sudan Medical Service maintains 53 medical dispensaries, each in charge of a fully qualified medical assistant. Regular visits are made to the schools to keep an eye on the general health of the pupils. In this elementary school, over 200 boys are undergoing a four years course of training. At one time, the Sudanese didn't like the idea of sending their girls to school. Now there is a great demand for education. The head headmistress is employed by the local rural council. In each district, there is even a trained midwife who is stationed at each dispensary. A donkey provides the means of transport to her patients' homes. And here always the eternal question, will it be a boy or a girl? <laughs> 